Hi, my name is Ken Neppel and I'm a urologic oncologist at the University of Iowa. That's a urologist who specializes in cancer surgery. I'm going to talk to you today about a less invasive approach for removing part of the kidney called robotic assisted partial nephrectomy. For a patient diagnosed with the kidney mass, this is a schematic of a kidney. There's the meat of the kidney, where the urine's stored, and the artery and the vein that go to the kidney. You can see there's a mass off the side of this kidney that is suspicious for cancer. In this situation, traditionally, the whole kidney may have been removed to try to get cancer control. However, over the last several years, we've learned that you can remove just part of the kidney to keep patients with more of their kidney tissue to function. Additionally, previously, when surgery was done for a partial nephrectomy, if this is an abdomen with the head being up here and the feet down here, this is the umbilicus or the belly button, for doing an open approach for removing part of the kidney, the incision is either on the flank in between the ribs, which can be quite painful, or underneath the ribs, sometimes extending all the way to the other side of the abdomen, which can have an effect as far as patient recovery and pain after surgery. However, with a laparoscopic approach, which is using small keyhole incisions, insufflating or blowing up the abdomen with carbon dioxide, and then exposing the tissues using laparoscopic incisions controlled by the surgeon outside of the patient, there are some strong potential benefits to laparoscopic surgery. For laparoscopic surgery, rather than these large incisions, small keyhole incisions, less than an inch in size, can be used to place the instruments. Specifically, for robotic-assisted surgery, a robotic console is wheeled to the patient, connect it to the instruments, then I can sit at the surgical console. What my hands do is what the instruments do inside of the body. In this case, the robot doesn't actually do the surgery, it does what the surgeon tells it to. The potential benefits of a less invasive approach for kidney tumor surgery is faster recovery, the typical hospital stay, after an open surgery, maybe four or five days, after a robotic-assisted partial nephrectomy, we will have patients going home on average the second day after surgery, and in some cases, even the morning after the surgery. Additional benefits are clearly less pain to the patient, and then the long-term consequences, most important benefit is that there's an opportunity to keep the kidney function nearly equivalent to what it was before surgery and clearly improved compared to removing the whole kidney. And the most important aspect is for cancer control. There's long-term data showing that removing part of the kidney is safe for cancer control. And it has these other benefits potentially to the patient.